Rhythm of Life, officially launched in 2014, operates in the red lights districts of Kampala. It is majorly focusing on providing the welfare of these stigmatized women and girls through career development and health care training. I'm a teen mother. Mm, the condition was not easy for me because I was the mother at the same time I was the father. I suffered, the life was very hard for me. I even disliked myself knowing that nobody loves me by that time. So I, my mother chased me from home. My sisters disliked me that I'm nothing, I'm useless. So I ended, I ended up on streets. Such testimonies positioned Harriet the founder in ensuring that Rhythm of Life grows into a platform that ends the cycle of a mother to a daughter prostitution. At the age of 16, I watched a personal friend drop out of school, join the sex work industry to take care of the siblings because the mother was normal. Of course, as a young girl, it is something that triggered my understanding. Growing up and having all these experiences, I had no other concern that I wanted to address apart from addressing the vicious cycle of mother to daughter prostitution. Because yes, there are so many concerns in the world, but this is the world that I knew. This is the world that I grew up in, and these are the issues that I looked at every single day. In 2019, Rhythm of Life partnered with Jimmy Sekasi Institute, where girls and women acquired hands-on skills. We had an MOU or a partnership with Jimmy Sekasi Institute that has done the training for two months, and these girls and women can be able to do a number of things, ranging from cakes to bread to samosas to the Rolexes to the half cakes. So we believe after the training they can go out there, start up their small scale businesses other than going to the streets and be happy as well as being economically sustainable. You know, I disliked myself before whereby no, friends was, no friend was there for me, nobody was there for me, so I disliked everybody. I only remained with my God. So I said, let me be with my God because nobody loves me because I gave birth. When you look for jobs, men, they want to use you that first meet me in the hotel because you need a job. But now I can do my own job, can do my, I can do anything and I get my money. And I thank Rhythm of Life for that good opportunity they have given me. Thank you very much. I Rhythm of Life in the two months we have taught them how to love this and then in loving it they, it's becoming part of them at this point as they are winding up with their products you think that there's an improvement these ladies they can now prepare most of these things on their own as they are doing it right now and they are going to start their own businesses so that they can change their own lives. This is my life, I is a man in your child, my community, or whatever, and I'm going training, or you give your color. And uh, at this point in time, we thank uh, Rhythm of Life that has come into this intervention in the areas of, uh, in the division of Makinge. And uh, we hope uh, what they are doing, your intervention, is going to transform a life. And not only these ones, but uh, so many lives are going to be transformed. We are so optimistic about where we are heading. We are planning to have what we call a health cafe. Uh, something that can be an umbrella that houses all our different programs. A health cafe will be an, um, an avenue where the women and girls can walk in and access the different healthcare services as well as the sexual and reproductive health rights. But we know red light districts are not only in Makindi, 
they are as far as borders, you know, like maybe Uganda, Rwanda, Uganda, Kenya, different borders where all these things still continue to happen. So we plan to scale up to the different regions in the country and continue to provide the services and also create that holistic transformation for these girls and women. You just be determined that I have this fight.